You know what's funny? Every single time that this box shows up at my door, I'm surprised, I am excited, filled with joy because this box just it's so different and I've really been enjoying it. This is the ice cream beauty box. I'm gonna go ahead and open her. I wanted to show you guys. So you know how like I remove the peach fuzz off of my face and I shape my brows with these little um, like little razors. You know how I like to multitask an item. So I'll go ahead and I'll use these razors once. They're like no longer good for like the skin, you know, cause they start tugging and stuff. Instead of throwing it out, I'll usually like save one and use it to open up my boxes when they get here in the mail. That way I don't have to use Use scissors and I don't have to use um, like knives and stuff. They always package everything so so well. This is the bag, so be ready. We're gonna um, feature that tomorrow, so be ready, ready, ready. And here we have <gasps> the box. Wait, it's upside down, it's upside down. The box. We're gonna go ahead and open the box today. So this is the Ice Cream Beauty box. They have a bag as well, like I just showed you guys. In the description box, I'm gonna have all the details on this a box as like price point, the amount of items you would get. They typically feature basically like all makeup, maybe every once in a while. I think once I got like a skincare item, other than that, everything has been makeup. And I do have a discount code in the link to their site down in the description box so everything you need to know you're gonna find there i just want to go ahead and dive on in and yes all of the items in this box in a video we're gonna try them so that you can see them in action however the reality is my face is on why i wanted to feel good about myself today that's really why because i'm not really going anywhere and we're gonna go ahead and open her up this is the september box it is the autumn at dawn there's one two three, four, five. There's five full-size items, but one of them has a times two, which means there should be two of those in there. So let's see. And they always like make sure that everything arrives so like in good shape, which is awesome. Okie dokie, artichoke. Let's go ahead and dive on in. The first item says, My Skinny Mask Australia. Uh, it is a turmeric and vitamin C clay mask. How much do you go for? This is a $40 product. Let's smell her. I don't think I've tried this brand ever. <gasps> Ooh, is this not cute? I'm a sucker for baby brushes. Like I will not necessarily use them consistently, but the fact that they're babies is cute. At least I find them cute. And here is the, pa oh, this packaging is kind of luxe and heavy. It's glass. If you've tried this brand before, please let me know down below. I'm learning of like a whole bunch of new brands. So that's exciting. Oh, it's nice and tight. You know, it's funny. It kind of smells like turmeric, but not. Like it actually is unscented in a sense. Here is the color of the mask. And that is what it looks like inside the jar. It's a nice heavy jar, 40 bucks. Okay, I can't say whether or not the $40 are justified. Cause again, I've never actually tried the brand. So this is like new to me. And I really like that it came with a little like brush applicator. Next, they featured the Beauty Crops Coco Rose Blush Palette. This is supposed to retail for $15 hairs. And now that I said doll hairs, by the way, I do see this little cockatoo I have going on. Listen, I see it. I've been having a bad hair day since yesterday. My hair is clean, but it's I, I don't know what in the world is actually going on. So we are gonna act like this is not there, okay? Like we're just gonna act like it doesn't have a mind of its own and it's living its best life. We're just ignoring it, we're bypassing it, it's fine. Why do I feel like I've seen something similar to this, like at least the packaging? Do I have this already? I'm not even gonna swatch it because I, I may may actually have it. I'm gonna look into my collection before touching everything actually. Here it is. I literally was just looking at a palette, putting things together for one of my sisters, and I feel like this resembles something I have. So if it resembles it, but I don't already own it, then of course I'll dive on in and play around with this one. But if I already have her and I have one that's open, then I'll set this to the side to share it with one of you guys, because of course I don't need Play around with two of them you know so that's pretty cool the palette is pretty the shades are nice you have one that's kind of like mm, i'm a blush but like i could be a highlighter too so it's cute it's cute all right there is two of one specific item but they're two different colors before i get into it 
please make sure you are subscribed to my channel. The little subscribe button is right down here. All you have to do is hit that red button. It'll automatically subscribe you to the channel so you can join the Jody G family here on the YouTube. While you're there, please hit the notification bell. That way YouTube lets you know every single time I upload a brand new video and or provide an update over on my community page. With that said, if you do not mind, right below this video, you're gonna see a thumbs up button. If you can click that button, I'd really appreciate it. It basically tells YouTube I like her channel. I like the vibe. I'm enjoying the content. Please recommend her to people who have the same interests as I do. And that in essence helps me grow my channel. So I would really, really appreciate it if you went ahead and hit the like button for me. And I just wanna say thank you for that. All right, let's move on into the next two items. The next items are liners, but here's the thing. These liners are multitaskable. You can uh, like apply them on your eyes and or your lips, which I think is pretty cool because if you end up getting a lippy that you're like, man, I would never apply that on my lips. You could always use it on your eyes. So that's cool. You get two of them. They're by Appeal Cosmetics. The card says it retails for $42 the two, which I think is kind of insane. So you're meaning to tell me that one of them is $21. That's crazy, but whatever. Okay, so we have the shade Muse and then we have the shade Deep Taupe. I don't have either of these, so we will go ahead and twist. By the way, this is how I open them. I learned this like yesterday, not yesterday, but you know what I mean? Like I learned this kind of late and I would always just do one of these and really try and struggle and take forever. And it would, uh, it was kind of annoying because like when you're filming videos, you don't want to sit here and be like picking at plastic, you know, especially when you're on crunch time and the baby is sleeping. I learned this maybe like a year or so ago, maybe a little more. Anyway, when it has like clear plasticky thingy, you just twist. And then eventually you can like peel it off if you have the time, but th that's crazy, right? So here we have Deep Taupe. I'm gonna swatch that. This would be beautiful. Like it's like a, it reminds me of Coco Bear by Makeup Geek. Um, when Makeup Geek was still a thing, it's a nice Coco Bear type of liner. Again, this would be beautiful on the eyes and or on the lips. And then the shade Muse, I feel like this is more of a lip something. And then maybe this could go well for an accent wing with like a black line underneath just to accentuate a little bit. But that's pretty too. But that's more of a lip color in my opinion. These are nice. I've tried these formulas. The formulas are nice. They're creamy. They're pigmented. They're not dry, which is really, really nice. So I'm not mad at that. $42 though, um, appeal. $21 for one is kind of insane to me. Just saying. But thank you, Ice Cream Beauty Box, for including a $21 liner, well, two of them, in your box, which is exciting. Next, I have a Girlactic product. Now, this is their smudge eraser stick. It retails for 17 doll hairs, and I'm curious because technically, what this is supposed to do is remove mistakes. I'm hoping it's supposed to remove mistakes without it ruining the rest of your makeup. I don't know how this works. I've never heard of it. I think this is pretty cool. Considering it's $17, I mean, it's affordable in my opinion. So I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna twist her up. It's a clear product, as you guys can see. I'm gonna twist her up and we are going to kind of do one of these. I don't know if this is working or is not working. I, oh God, I'm trying to see without seeing, but see without seeing. So as you see, I'm kind of like blending back and forth. I'm bringing it up. Attempting to erase the lip liner swatches that I did on the back of my hand, as you guys can see. It's, I mean, is it doing it? Yes. It feels waxy, kind of like a hard oil. Not hard, but you know what I mean? Like a solidified oil. So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna take a cotton swab. Okay, so in essence, it's picking up fairly easily. So let's just say you end up getting mascara here, down here somewhere on your lid and you're like, I do not know how to remove this. I mean, if you don't know any of the hacks but you own this, this might actually be helpful. I, it's a smudge remover. So it seems to me like when we do the try on, I'm gonna have to purposely go ahead and smudge something on my face in order to see how it works and all of that. But I'm gonna look into it. I'm gonna look into it just to see like, it's full potential and then we'll play around with it on video, which is gonna be exciting. And then the last, although I feel like I've gone through this box kind of fast. The mask, the face palette, the liners, that's three. Smudge remover, four. Item number five. Item number five is also by The Beauty Crop. It is a face, uh, I, a face palette, oh my God, I already showed you guys the face palette. This is the Dawn Gazing Palette. 
It's an eyeshadow palette, I think, and it retails for $15 hairs. Mm. And this is what the inside looks like. Let me take the little um plasticky plastic. I like that they do this. They have like the little plastic tape. Ice Cream Beauty Box knew exactly what they were doing. This is a fall palette. This is like getting you ready for like, ooh, October, November, is it not? She's very pretty. By the way, this was me. Kind of like when I went like this to remove the plastic wrap, I dug my finger into the plastic, which pushed it in and created like a little dent in there. So that was me. This is really pretty. So you have some peaches, you have some like brownie shades, but they're not full brown. They're like definitely like some deep wine colors. You have this pressed glitter, which we're gonna swashy swatchy. Then you have some deep frosty shades. You have like a nice brick color. So this is definitely a palette that is usable, that you can multitask, you can go light, and pretty with these, you can actually just do one over the lid or you can, cause you have matte. So this is really nice. I want to kind of go like this. Wow, okay, I'm not mad at her. That was like a swirl like this and here you go. <laughs> I'm gonna tap this on the back of my hand because I have to. When it comes to this type of glitter, what's really awesome is typically if you pat it into place, it stays wherever it is that you applied it and it's like a nice topper you can you can really do a lot with this kind of glitter i've enjoyed just tapping some on the inner corner just so that it'll like catch the light in a different way versus like what i have going on this is just your regular frosty shadow just popping some of this on the inner corner kind of transforms the look and kind of makes it fun uh, a little bit of this on the center of the lid looks pretty or all over the lid this kind of palette will get you ready for like the holidays for sure so this beauty box did their thing this month i liked it oh my god i literally went in with a like a paper towel and dragged and it took most of it off, but it still has some stuck to my hand. So that tells you, it's really not gonna move around much, which is really great. I really like that formula so far, at least of the glitter, because I didn't swatch anything else. This box was really good. What do you guys think? I know a lot of you guys are already subscribed. You guys were the ones that wanted me to start unboxing this box anyway, but I want to hear you guys' thoughts. Did you get your box? Are you looking forward to receiving your box? Are you excited? Is there anything that you like are going to dive on into first? I really want to know and again if you're not already subscribed to the ice cream beauty box i do have the link and all the details down below in the description box make sure you go check it out click the link to navigate to the website and of course use the discount code so you can get a discount on your very first box okay girl and that is a wrap for today's video i really hope you guys have enjoyed it please don't forget to hit the like button because it really 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 helps me out again thank you and i'll see you guys in tomorrow's beauty bag unboxing bye guys Thank <laughs> you.